Hi, I'm Emily Palethorpe, and I'm really excited to be joining the CLS for a performance of Richard Strauss's seminal oboe concerto. Richard Strauss wrote his concerto in 1945, and every time I come back to it, I am blown away by the fact that in the midst of the devastation of Europe, where Strauss was writing, let's just pause for a minute to think that millions were dead, millions were homeless, he was writing in rubble and destruction, and yet he chooses to write the most youthful, sort of heaven-searching, joyous, heroic piece that we can imagine. I've always been really interested in the resilience of the human spirit. I practice as a psychotherapist as well. And when I come back to this piece, this is what I think of. Uh, it's just a stunning example of heroism, of the human spirit rising out of the ashes. There is something about the oboe which calls to composers to write when there's something really deep and special, sort of heart-wrenching that they want to describe. Uh, Strauss was not alone as being a composer that wrote one of his last works for the oboe. And I think as oboists, we need to be mindful of that special quality of the instrument that we are um, gifted with presenting. Uh, so I hope you'll be a little intrigued and want to join us on the 20th of April at St. John Smith Square for a performance of Strauss's heroic, heaven-searching, uh, Mozartian concerto.